Thanks for stopping by. My name is Sean and I love that song. Hey, I want to talk to you today about the things that, um, the uh, sort of like a checklist before you make an offer on the price and the terms of negotiation. When I write an offer for my buyers, basically, I, I ask the uh, listing agent on a phone call, not text. I mean, typically, phone call is the best way to get some good information about the seller who is on the other side represented by the listing agent. I ask them, why are they selling? Are they flexible on the price? Um, uh, so, and the other thing is what kind of activity that they're getting since they listed, closing time for the seller, what, what other important things other than the price. When I gather all that information, typically I have a good sense of what it would take to make that deal happen for you. Um, and if it's a multiple offer situation, obviously the conversation is completely different. Whatever to make your offer look the best, right? Without paying the most. I mean, and there are other ways to do that. Uh, and so please let me know um, if you have any questions about this because it's not a clean cut thing. I mean, it's a, there's many different things kind of mixed in together to get you the best house for the best price in the terms. So feel free to let me know. Thanks for watching.